Moby, remember tonight's Hanukkah, so I want you home early for dinner because we're gonna play Spin the Dreidel with Sammy, Yetta, and Ma. Yeah, I'll take worst ideas in the world for 500, please, Alex. <laughs> Sammy, can I help you with anything? You know, if you can get me some more paper towels, I'd appreciate it. They make them in paper now? <laughs> yeah, then why don't you just play with your chocolate dreidel? <laughs> I'm right here, baby. Ah, yeah. yeah. uh, Fran. Yes, my darling. Explain something to me, please. What? Uh, why do all the Jewish holidays start at sundown? Ah, uh, well, that's because God realized that before five, to wear sequins is gauche. <laughs> Look, everyone, Mr. Sheffield's sister came from England to stay with us without any notice whatsoever. How happy am I? <laughs> oh, Jocelyn, it's so good to see you. Ditto. <laughs> and congratulations on the baby. We were all so excited to hear you're expecting a child. You were? Well, it explained the wedding. <laughs> OK. You remember my grandmother and her boyfriend? They sat next to you at the engagement party. You choked on a chicken bone, and he saved your life. He gave you a bottle of scotch to calm your nerves. Sammy! How are you? So, what are you doing here? Well, I flew in to surprise this man I've met. Listen to this. He's 36, fabulous taste, and a stunning apartment, which he did by himself. Do you realize what that means? He likes Barbara Streisand and James Brolin? <laughs> no, I finally met my equal. Oh. Why don't you and Max join us for drinks tonight at Nello's? Oh, no, we couldn't possibly leave. Tonight is the first night of Hanukkah and the first night that we're going to spend it as a family. Max knows how important it is to me. Well, I'm off to Boston. <laughs> oh, I hope that wasn't Max. 